Surprise, fans have a lot to say about this blockbuster trade. Eyewitness News anchor Siapa Lewis is in South Philadelphia with reaction. Siapa. As you well know, eight months have passed since the Sixers 2020-2021 season ended in a painful and bitterly disappointing Game 7 playoff loss to Atlanta here at the Wells Fargo Center. Today, as Ben Simmons and many Sixers fans have wanted since that Father's Day loss, Simmons was finally traded. Here's what some fans are saying. I think it worked out for both sides. I, I see a lot of people saying it's slanted one way or slanted the other way. I think it's great for both. It's the first time we've got a superstar wanting to come to this city in my lifetime. AI was birthed here and B was birthed here. No stars ever wanted to come here and I'm 32. We had a star that came out openly this morning and said I want to be a sixer. Get him here. And they got him here. I'm happy. We couldn't be happier. We all we got done work today. We came out celebrating the trade and happy to wave goodbye to Simmons. Let's get Harden and we're going to the finals. Now, now, I don't know if this will surprise you or not, but I also found someone who isn't happy with the move. They took a big L. Who? Who took a big L? 76ers. They let go of Seth Curry in the deal. Wasn't supposed to do that. Let go of lethal shooter. The Nets won. The trade overall. I also asked if folks were happier that Simmons, who refused to play for the Sixers this season, is gone, or the fact that future Hall of Famer James Harden is headed here. It's a good question. Simmons being gone. And unlike some national prognosticators and experts, few worry about Simmons' impact on his new team in Brooklyn. At the end of the day, I don't care where he goes. He's doing us no good being here, being paid and not playing basketball. Simple as that for me. And we got a superstar in return. I, I think Stephen A. Smith and I'm wrong. They haven't seen him enough. We lived for it for a lot of years, and good luck with him in the playoffs. We'll see him at the foul line. <laughs> yes, we will see him at the foul line. As you know, the Sixers host Oklahoma City here tomorrow, the Cleveland Cavaliers on Saturday, and on Tuesday they're back to host the hated Boston Celtics. If I had to bet on it, I'm thinking that is the night James Harden will make his Sixers debut live at the Wells Fargo Center. Seattle Lewis, CBS3 Eyewitness News. That made both of us smile. We'll see you at the foul line. All right, buddy, thanks so much.